it. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Thursday broadcast here on the Gwenny Be Dead channel. We have it. It's cyberpunk. Look. And I have the, um, I'm Gwen. This is my channel. Welcome. Hi. Uh, cyberpunk. Uh, we're making this, uh, we're making her as Daryl Hannah as Pris as possible here. Um, but I wanted to start off the broadcast with a photosensitivity warning. This broadcast slash VOD contains flashing lights and or images that may affect photosensitive viewers. Your best discretion is pleased to be advised. I will um, try to let you know when I think something flashy is coming up. I spent all day playing this. I've got a, a another character. She's a nomad. I've been playing her all day. But yes, um, if you are photosensitive, may I suggest maybe not watching this stream. Uh, the game has been known to affect people uh, to understand that a jerk uh, suffered a jerk so hopefully uh, some of the that I didn't I didn't see any uh, in the accessibility options um, but hopefully now uh, we can get a patch for that and I can put that up so that my uh, photosensitive friends can go ahead and watch. Uh, we've got the nudity censored, we've got the uh, copyrighted music censored, so I think we're all set to go. Let's do this. Actually what I want to do is hit the options real quick and um, turn uh, uh, down the volume because I don't know how the levels are if you're out there please let me know how the levels are and welcome to cyberpunk what a good time she's gonna be a street kid uh, Pris here Daryl Hannah as Pris as V Sadly, I couldn't make her hair any more blonde than that. That's as blonde as it'll go. I was trying to make it white, but no such luck. No idea what's going on right now. Because I actually haven't played this path. I played the Nomad Path today. Right. Settings. Audio. All right, let's bring down the volume some. Oh, not all the way, geez. About 50 something percent. Actually, I'll put that at 65. All right. That should do it. That should do it just fine. 
Okay, back to it. Let me know how my levels are. Can you hear me? Can you hear the game? Some bastard tried to mug So that's as Daryl Hannah as I could get her. <laughs> as Pris. You really think somebody local tried to mug as me, Pepe? Listen, V. I got a problem. Serious this time. Found yourself in a hole, sounds like. I need help. So welcome no, to Cyberpunk, you guys. I am so it's excited. I've been playing it all day. I owe him. Don't pay by you know, uh, said he bust my legs. You know how you don't anxious I was stuff. yesterday? Got cartels in his corner. There was literally you one mean, other customer cook? who came in after I did at the, at the store. Fucking shark. Uh, everything is my playing bro jumped the joint. just the hero fine. I haven't even run into I any bugs yet. Seriously. You ever gonna get wise, Pepe? Nothing went wrong. It was all very smooth today. Um, uh, doing his thing, you know. Which I knew. So, can you help? Of course I can, I'll Pepe. Talk to Kirk, but then you're gonna owe me one. All right. Welcome to Cyberpunk 2077, guys. First time in Night City. Not for me, but maybe for you. Pay close attention to the tutorials to learn more about the basic mechanics of the game. So I'll be um, taking you through these as well. Um, oh, it only took three hours, uh, surprisingly, to load, uh, to install all the patches, all the everything. Three hours. Very easy. I just hung out on Facebook and made myself some lunch. It was fantabulous, you guys. I'm telling you. Ah. Uh, or if you're already an experienced edge runner, feel free to disable hints. No, I'm not disabling hints. I love Mr. Hinty. We're fans on this channel. Go to the database at any time during the game to access tutorials as well as to read up on the most important topics of Cyberpunk 2077. You're saving my life, V. Truly. Hi. Oh. All right. Uh... Okay. A little bit of lag. Ooh, sorry. Well, I haven't been in here yet, so I'm just kind of having a look around. Ooh, can I play a game? <gasps> Let me play a game. No. Hair wax? Alright. <laughs> I'll take some hair wax. Hey, shouty, what's happening? Alright, this bloke. Hey, Kirk. Wanna talk? V. Been a while? Spin it. What you need? Pepe asked me to talk you up. What, he too shot a hand over the Yetis himself? Uh, tell him I don't fight. Not yet. Hell's your problem. What's he owe you? Afraid that's client confidentiality. Call it a lot, and leave it at that. A cred shark with business ethics. Sounds too good to be true. Well, Merry fucking Christmas. Cut him some slack, will ya? He'll pay. Just needs some more time. Do I look like a priest that runs a charity to you? You borrow Eddie's, you gotta pay him back. With interest. It's common fucking knowledge. 
You suggesting I let a flaky cunt who can't keep a deal off the hook? No. You let him off because it's me asking. Huh. You know me. I'm a man of the bids. So I need to know what I get out of it. Oh, you want it. Oh, you favor. Transactions go two ways. I get that. I'll owe you a favor. Hey. Captain. Got a Nova idea already. What's this? Grab a look. Mm-hmm. Cream ride there on the page. Only four of them in NC as of now. One, Rayfield Regional Director. Ooh, Two, we're gonna steal a car. Nine. Fun! Three, a rental service. Uh-huh. And four? I did not get to steal a car as a nomad. To my client, just as soon as you clep it for me, that is. I do this, and Pepe's debt is squared? Of course. I'm a man of my word. You know that. Whole thing simple. You swipe the Rayfield for me, I clear Pepe's account. Even toss in a cut for you, I'm such a nice guy. My what man a Rick sweetie. A structure by what club where a, a thoughtful sweetheart of a man, huh? As soon as you appear, security cam shut down, gate swings up. The road is yours. Just gotta grab the Rayfield and roll out. Simple. And your man, Rick? Trust him like my own brother. Plant sounds shaky as fuck. Oh, mm -hmm. how so? Sounds like you're looking for a sucker. This ain't no setup, V. Heard you got a good head. Maybe we help each other make a few eddies. Who's the owner? Just an Arasaka suit from across the water. Spews cash out of every hole in his body. And his name? How would I know? Why would I care? It's a hot item, and I know where to find it. All right, How fine. am I supposed to do this? Expect me to slide under the chassis on a skateboard for a quick hot wire? Fast and easy? Kirk, wheels like this got security systems. Good ones. This bitty bop works like the key Rayfield bitty, bitty Pex used for repairs. Opens locks, bypasses identity authorization. A skeleton key for all Rayfields in the city. Oh, come on, Kirk. Even you don't buy that. Kabuki's tech wizards sell more magical shit than this under the counter. Have a little fit. So I've been having a lot of fun with this so, today. We all agreed then. All right, agreed. Yeah. Glad to hear it. Always said you were a bright bulb. Head to Ember's in the Glen. Rick's in the garage. Be waiting for you. You two will hit it off. Good luck out there. We'll be in touch. Quad racer. Oh, that sounds like a fun ass game. Stairs down. No. Where can I get a drink around here, yo? So how's it gonna be? Kirk's letting you go. I'm not though. I'm fucking only good. V, you're saving my life. I mean that. You fucking drink, Pepe. Fine. Later. I will get a drink later.
I can Fat ass motherfucker. Hey, why do I see no goddamn lemons? No goddamn limes? They're in there, for sure. Lemons and limes, folks. Lemons and limes. Sure. Here. All yours. Knew I saw good in you. God bless. Yeah, yeah. Maybe you'll help me out later. Cybernetic God comes to devour its children. <laughs> yeah, you bet it do. Yes, Padre. Well, who do we have here? We? Long time. Didn't know you were around. Yep, no place like home. Got back from Atlanta a few weeks ago. See, you got a good down home welcome. How was it back east? Tell you later. Got something on my plate. How about you fill me in now? We'll give you a ride. Okay, that sounds great. Marcus, let's go. Give me a ride. Love it. So where to? The Glen. Drop me off at Embers. Please. Front door? Take the ramp back of the bar. Show you where to stop. You heard him, Marcus. And this, folks? Your return to NC has been good. It's beautiful. Is you ready? Two years gone by, not much has changed. You know how you would. It has strong roots, never watered by the same blood. Now, tell me about you. About me? I'll pick up something here and there. Nothing major. But I'm getting by. Appreciate the concern. So... Night City. Atlanta didn't turn out like you expected, huh? As you nope. can see, I'm back. If it had been better there, wouldn't have left. Maybe it'll all work out for the best. Maybe it will. Shit. Hella. Stop the car. What's going on? Please. Jeez, I should grab the you controller. Uh, yeah. I think. I got fists anyways. Sebastian Ibarra. Looks like it's my lucky day. What do you want? To settle our biz once and for all. Get I like his head plate. Patty, so listen up. Get the fuck out of Vista. Pull your boys off the street. I'll give you the Glen. Done deal. No more restless nights. See how generous I can be. Well, Patty. One more fucking word. Stay out of this. I don't know you. And I don't know you. Which means you're worth shit around here and capable of even less. Well, anything else? It seems our conversation has come to a close. Yeah, fuck off, mister. I do Careful, like your Padre. mohawk got a barrel at your six. head you plate, though. Shit bucket. Marcus, please. Thank you, Marcus. I'm pleased to see you have not forgotten your roots. Still have them here. So many of the little shits left around here. Their spines go soft when they look down a barrel. Who was he? No one important. A Every lot of these responses are timed, you'll know. Another will come in his place. He pulled iron on you. He did. And he will pay for doing so. Pull up here. Right here. I'll just drop down below. Here, before you go. Ooh. 
Hex, your number? Could be useful. Maybe we can also work together again. I would love Take that. back two years. Thanks, Padre. Gotta go. So go with God. Do you like her fun nails? I do. Hi. All right. First of all, let's get us a beverage, huh? This is too much. <sighs> Bro, I am trying. To have some beverage here. I don't know what flavor it'll be. But it'll be delicious if I can do it. Can I get it to work? Ah, there we go. Let's try the middle one. Nicola Blue. What does Nicola Blue do? Let's check our inventory, shall we? Here we have the menus. Huh. And here we have Daryl Hannah as Pris as V. Okay. Looks like I've got two pairs of streetwear pants. Two pairs of street tongues. All right, that's weird. I looking for consumables. Okay, I don't have anything in the backpack. That is Nicola Blue. It applies the hydration status, which increases max stamina by 10% and regen by 50% per second. I'm good. For now. V? Status. On location. About to find your man. Rick's one of the good guys, you'll see. I trust him like a brother. Yeah, so you say. Stealing a car. I get to steal a car in Cyberpunk. Are you Rick? Rick? Yep. You with Kirk? Yep. yep. Camera's blind. You got 20 minutes. Thank you. Oh, that looks fancy. Kirk, I see the ride. Your moment to shine, kiddo. Good luck.
able to lock using Kirk's device. Oh. This is it. <laughs> Let's take this piece of wonder tech for a whirl. You're a woman of little faith. See? We're rich. Now fire her up and call me when you're underway. I'll tell you where to go. Looks like this will be a cool breeze. Yes, okay. Ah, oh, fuck out. Shit. Get uh. the fuck out. Okay. Easy. Nothing personal, Gopa. Just biz. Rayfield's mine. What man? Never heard of thieves' honor? Finders keepers, I was first. Listen, only one of two ways to do this. Friendly or fucked up. Either way, the ending's the same. I'm taking the car. Wh what are you doing? The Chingalos? Yeah, the Chingalos. Don't move. You're under arrest. Oh, you asshole. Jackie. Jackie didn't pull an asshole move like this on me in the other playthrough. Jackie Wells, my old pal from the hood. See you haven't grown an ounce white. Hey, Detective Stitz. Been a while, huh? Inspector Stitz. Same shit. Speaking of. Your Hello. mom's familiar too. Uh. Come on, spit it out. I'm waiting. Left for Atlanta. Looking for a slice of happiness. Guess you didn't find it. I've always maintained it's the same for all you termites in Haywood. Born here, live here, die here. Looks like I was right. You know fuck all about me. Truth hurts, huh? Just watch your tone. I'm not a patient man. Come on, Stint. Well, I only lived for four years, so and two you years are clearly up. gone. So uh, I mean, and then what? You think I'm patient? We get some months. Standing room only nowadays in El Bote. No, they'd probably be out early. Are these the thieves? Fuck ordinary Jesus. street trash. Got him in custody, Mr. Fujioka. We'll be taking him now. It's a waste of effort. I have no time to testify or play it on an investigation. Suggesting we let him go, sir? I said to yeah, let us go. Them in the sea. Cop legs broken so this trash doesn't flow. Ah, oh, jeez. You heard him. Oh man, I just reset my nose too. Lame. Lame. So you've all probably seen like the first two hours of this game. At least. Motherfucker. Ugh. Or are playing this game. Right now. Honestly, for a sec there, things looked iffy. Wasn't sure we'd worm out of that alive. Yeah, Alright. Stence is out to get people. Wow. Though he does have a little honor left. Really think his sense of honor saved us? Well, and the fact he's Haywood born and bred like us. If I hadn't come, you'd be cruising Night City in sexy wheels right now. That's right. No. It wasn't gonna work anymore. Come on. Job was toxic from the start. Even Kabuki under the counter magic can't get around an alarm like that. Should have known I'd have the PD on my ass. So, maybe now, as God ordained, Jackie Wells. V. I know you. 
You hang at the Coyote. Got the job to steal those wheels at the Coyote. From Kirk. You work with that sewer slug? Pepe owes him big, and can't afford to pay, so I stepped up. Man, gotta wonder about Pepe letting slimy Kirk boss him around like that. Heard what they say. He's backed by cartels. Cartels? No, no, listen. I know those cartel types, and I guarantee you, none of them have even heard of Kirk. El cabrón gotta learn. You don't do people in Haywood dirty. Come on. Let's go have some lunch. Yeah, I'm hungry. Lunch? <laughs> you would not believe my mama's chili. Best in town. Getting one of my good feelings. About what? About us. Just the kind of chemistry. Come on. I'm fucking starved. All right, let's okay, go. Food it is. Let's go. Of course, after the broadcast tonight, I'll be going back to my main campaign, my personal campaign with all of the nudity and copyrighted songs. Hello there, Night City! Hello! Stanley here with you, and we got another day ahead of us in this city of dreams! Ooh, I love this town. Love it like you might love a mother who popped you out on the steps of an orphanage once and now stops you to ask if you got a smoke for her. <laughs> Every new day here means a hundred Different montage. Arrivals, but only half these gods will survive a year. Cool. Different montage in the Nomad and why playthrough. The come down and see? Well, to be street samurai like Morgan, Black We have the same hair. Oh, God. <laughs> Some of it's the same. NC's legends. Know where you'll find most of them? The graveyard. Matters not where you're from. Matters not where you start. What matters here is the walk you walk. In Night City. The city of I made her eyes pretty funky, too. They've got little hearts in them. And I like her nails. The load screens are a bit long, but the chick hey, we're looking for is somewhere in that's the all right. Probably crawling with the pendejos that kidnapped her. Eyes and ears open, all right? Speaking of which, got you a little something. Little dick training shard. In case you need to uh, brush up on your dance moves. Down for some target practice in VR? How'd you military. get this, Jackie? Yeah, we're talking classified military grade tech here. How did you get it? T Bug and our girl made a couple adjustments. So I'm gonna skip the tutorial because I've been playing all day. Nah, said it didn't suit her uh, style. <laughs> You'll see what I mean. Not now, Jack. No time. Maybe later. Sure, sure. Mañana. Mañana. Will Kako give you any tips and tricks for the job? I'm not your mother. Just do what I pay you for. It's easy work. Yeah. Let's do this. Elevator. This way. 
All right, I don't have very high tech right now, so I don't know if I'll be able to unlock this door. Oh, it's me? Targets Sandra Dorset. Targets Biomon went mute a couple hours back. Suspected abduction. I'm gonna. Um. Do the sensitivity on. The controller. Store default on that. Yeah. Okay. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Reduces camera sensitivity when zooming. Huh. is the response curve. Controller inputs onto the floor plane. I don't know what any of that means. It's all fine. Already. Not sure you're in time. We're in time, Bug. We. Sure you're on phone, but that don't make you any less part of this squad. Squad. Charming. Calm the hell down, both of you. Almost there. Yeah, Bug. You folk. Okay. You follow Yaki. This. I'll take it. Looking for twelve thirty seven. Target should be inside, but I got Take zero it. eyes on her biomon. Fingers crossed it's not too late. Honest. Ugh, I hate this life or death shit. Hurry. Try hacking the door. Think you can trip it on your own, V? I don't know. Chonk, 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 chonk. Oh, wow, they censored the heck out of her. Oh, she's covered up. Sandra Dorset's protected Completely. under Echelon 2 Corpo immunity. Our girl's top shelf. This one's packing black market Zeta Tech repros. Typical back alley fix ups. Not our lucky gal. Let's keep looking. I 
do not have to kill this guy. Try it. Your toes. More bodies incoming. They're almost on you. Please fuck these creepers. Oh yeah, V. You're coming. Wait for your chance. Pick the prick off. Okay, you just wait. Down you go. Great job, Brian. There's more guys in here, but I don't know where. Right there. Okay. We're okay. Okay. Defeat scavenger leader. Oh shit. Could just shoot him. Ooh, 
something to read. Shit, I ripped my microphone out. Okay, something to read. Well, I wanted to read the thing. I'll read it for you next time. Ooh, Euro dollars. Fantastic. Oh, mommy. Flat out daughter, we could be that sneaky. Man, it's not my favorite way to roll, but no, but anyway. There's nothing interesting on the computers. Let's just grab everything we can. They're all dead. Hey, you know what? That went way more easily than the last time I did that. may wish to equip that. I think that's it. All right, let's go get her. Oh, wait. Ooh, something to read. Here we go. Cyberware usage and its side effects. Many people believe we live in a time when impossible has become an obsolete term. Ripper docs can replace nearly any part of the human body with artificial implants, from your big toe to portions of the nervous system. My years in trauma team, however, taught me that the impossible is still very much possible. E ah, even now, as we enter the twilight of the 21st century, we as medical professionals have not been able to eliminate all of the side effects that come from incorporating cybernetic elements into our bodies. Of course, everyone is familiar with the mental disorder most commonly referred to as cyberpsychosis, but it doesn't end there. Although advances in medical science for the greater part of a century have reduced its incidence to a minimum, cyberware rejection can still occur in a small subset of the population. These unlucky few can experience a range of complications, but the following are the most prevalent. One, immune, re immune response. The body rejects the implant, causing scar tissue to continue growing to the point that it causes pain and inflammation of surrounding tissue, as well as possible interference with the tech's electrical circuits. Two, psychological effects. Neurological implants have the potential to cause unpredictable change in the brain. Possible side effects include depression, apathy, hallucinations, and sudden increases in addictive behaviors, such as gambling. Three, implant overdependence. Long-term use of certain synthetic body part replacements can change the brain's chemistry to make it accustomed to a particular type of implant. There are reported cases of permanent blindness after patients attempted to replace their Kiroshi optical implants with a different models. In the face of these known risks, what should our outlook be as consumers and medical professionals? To, den to deny ourselves cybernetic enhancements on the 
0.5% chance we could lose our vision forever or gamble away our life savings at the casino? The clear answer is no. Cyberware technology has elevated human vi biology to the point where these what-if arguments serve against our best interests. The best advice I can offer for minimizing your risk is to read the technomedical profiles for all cyberware you intend to purchase before you install it. All right, let's go find this girl. Might be some interesting email. Hold on. No. No. Fuck it. Let's go get this girl. The day the tower fell? Ooh, something new to read as well. In early August 2023, a single event would change the course of history. Although it fell against the bloody backdrop of the Fourth Corporate War, the global media still fed on the story for weeks. And could you blame them? A group of terrorists detonated a nuclear bomb, blowing our Sokka Tower to pieces. The terrorists' warning came too late. Not all of the tower's employees could be evacuated. The blast itself killed and wounded thousands, while countless others died from radiation sickness. How did the biggest terrorist attack in the 21st century happen? Who was behind this catastrophe? To find the answers, we'll need to first understand the context of that era. The early 2020s was a period of unrest, for Night City and anti-corporate sentiment was at an all-time high. In the epicenter of the city's lawlessness stood the Atlantis Club. It was seen as an island of resistance against the powers that be, primarily megacorporations like Militech, or by though a special place in hell was reserved for Arasoka, the Japanese arms manufacturing Zaibatsu that held the most influence over Night City. The kinds of people who frequented the Atlantis felt that corporations had hijacked the future and turned people into consumers, and ironically, deprived of the two things capitalism loved most, freedom and choice. These people called themselves edge runners. They positioned themselves against the corporate world order. They declared their own freedom in opposition to the status quo, but deprived of any peaceful way to meaningfully change what they called the system man. They reached for more radical methods of self-expression, and these people were no strangers to violence. Right, let's go get this girl. Now, hopefully, the nudity Jesus filter Christ. will have covered her me. right up. I, mean, I got a stomach of steel, but this, oh, this, oh. yeah, they're wearing clothes. Okay, they were not wearing any clothes oh, in my first playthrough. <laughs> we make it? She alive? I have to find out. V, Jack and Tor Biomon need to know what we're dealing with. Does not look good. She's in a tub of ice, <coughs> crammed in with another. Fuck. Like slabs of meat. Keep it together, V. If she survives, she won't remember a thing. Tiny scar on the subconscious, that's all. Heard people who live through shit like this get panic attacks without ever knowing why. You'll be sipping a glass of ice cold water and suddenly your hands shaking. V, Jack into her biomon. We need to know what we're dealing with. Right, all right, already. Jacking in. Jacking in. Sandra Dorset, NC570442. Trauma Team Platinum. Platinum? Shit. Trauma should have swooped in if she sneezed. Guessing they jammed the transmitter, Sig. Looking at a hacked biomon, firmware reconfig, or a neurovirus. Carajo, T Bug. You ain't see at this place. This is tubs, ice, hooks, and cleavers. Hmm. It's pretty freaky. Scott Muncher's hack, huh? Got an idea. Check her neural cord. Find the shard? Yeah, pull it. That'll be what's muting the biomob. 
found the shard. We're moving now. Check the biomod. Anything changed? Greetings, Sandra. If you are conscious, assume recovery position now. An emergency evacuation unit has been dispatched and is due to arrive at your location in 180 seconds. Biomon Clave's trauma will be here in three minutes. Your premium plan All will cover right. 90% of the projected costs of your rescue and treatment. Hey, Scott Kelly. Yes. Let's Cyberpunk indeed. Ice. Jack, look sharp. Not done yet. Don't know who's out there. I've been playing all day uh, a different campaign with nudity and copyrighted um, music. <laughs> but I put all the filters on for the stream. So I'm highly irritated that I had to do so. V, need to know what's going on. Jackie Air Hypo. Fuck, this is bad. Catch Chica. <laughs> I think. Holy shit, it worked! Fuera, chica. Get her outside. All right, let's go. Mm. Scavrats abandoning ship. Must have seen trauma. Decided to cut their losses. Also, we killed most of them. Sign up for deadly, baby. Clear. Initiating security protocol. Follow all instructions. In the doorway. All right, in the doorway. Place Hello. The on the hey. Five steps back now. Yo. TT-133 to control. Patient NC-570442 secured. Stimulants being administered. 70 milligrams dopamine. 110 norepinephrine. 800 for Grenogen. So I did this quest in the, last, in the other campaign. Imagine much of it is the same. Direct. Good work. Shit show's over. Cut my wires now. See you in the near future. Listen, Chica, I got this thing. You mind if I borrow your wheels? Hmm. A thing. I'm a day with Misty, but I can't take the metro. How's I gonna look? Yeah, me? Misty has the exact well, same hair as, as us. Don't get used to it. Save it my ass, V. Thank you. How about I drive you home, huh? She's all yours. I'm beat as it is. Oh, almost forgot. She'll get Wakako in the hollow. Tell her the job's done. Wakako. Hi! Our client is alive and well. Yeah. Sure she's alive and well. It's what we agreed, isn't it? She am. Um, your payment awaits you. Ready to live. grab one right away. But I guess home is the only place you wish to be now. Yeah, because I have some cool shit at home. He has surrounded Watson. Yes, the I do. Is closed. If you're to make it past the cordon, you must move fast. Thanks for the heads up. Swing by to see you later. Words out the NCPD is gonna put Watson on lockdown. I'm gonna sleep in my own bed tonight. We better put it into bed. Leave it to me, Chica. I'm driving. Let's go. Are we going?
Okay, we are. We're gonna take this whole drive. We're not gonna skip the drive because it's a beautiful drive. No, chica, not just any other city. Morgan Blackhand, Andrew Wayland, Adam Smashed. Legends are born here. Gotta get there. I'm starving. Let's grab a tight bite. What do you say? Jackie, they're locking down Watson, remember? Oh shit, you're right. Is it just me or oh, fucking knew it? Better if I don't aim. Mierda, mierda! Got you, asshole! B, aim for the driver! Chingalo! <sighs> Scratched your face pretty bad. Sorry, V. It's okay. It can wait. Let's just focus on getting home. I'm not very good at shooting guns in this game. I think I'm gonna focus primarily on stealth kills because I'm not good with guns. Stops. Watson's on lockdown to further notice. Necessary security measure. Officer, ma'am! Damn, are we ever lucky we ran into you. Really? What's it that makes me so special? A uh, heart of gold? Because only somebody with a heart of gold can understand just how much I need to get back to my girl. Your girl? Uh-huh. Gonna be worried sick if I don't show. I mean, I'm trying to be a stand-up guy. She's giving me a chance. Waiting. Mm, that's a shame. Look at Come him. Come on. No model citizen, maybe, but he's a good kid. Let them through. But they're the last. Okay. Thank you. On your way. You have a good evening now, officer, ma'am. She took a like to you. She took a to you. The devotion I demonstrated grabbed her by the gun. Right. I'm loyal, stable in my affections. Yeah, mm -hmm. sure. And unassuming. You get it. I get it. You're great. You're great, Jackie. You're the best. your average badges. That's Max Tac. NCPD's Apex Predators. MTAC rolls in when things fly out of hand. Dogs out there though. Just a bit 
days that were on. Well, show's over. Poor bastards. But they had it coming. Get out of here as quickly as possible. Without drawing attention to ourselves. Made it. Almost at your place. What about you? Not likely to make it back to Haywood now. She'll be. They'll let me through. You sure about that? Oh, yeah. I'll play nice Jackie again. Oh, if you get car sick, dude, do not play this game. If you get car sick, probably watching this game has sweet dreams then. Made you. Tell Miss I said hi. I will. Terribly I unwell. Will. Take a drama meme is my advice. All right. Hey, we can level up. Oops. Let's go ahead and play. On the character sheet. So, um, I've given us a six in cool, which is stealth. A six in intelligence. A four in reflexes. Three in technical ability and body. Body is, of course, health and stuff. Technical ability is um, unlocking doors, tech weapons, that kind of stuff. Intelligence helps with uh, hacking. Reflexes help with guns. So I can up one of my attributes. And that's going to be reflexes. Because I need to definitely um, get better at guns. We'll attack ability next. Okay. And then we get perks. So we go in here and we get stealth perks. Um, so that's pretty groovy. Uh, crouching tiger increases movement speed while sneaking by 20%. So we're going to acquire a that. Fantastic. All right, I think that's it. This helps with evasion as well, reflexes do. And body, I think, helps with armor. Yeah, because I suck with the guns right now. But it might be a skill thing. This is based on uh, an actual tabletop role-playing game. So let's get home, huh? Good evening, nice city. Hi. 
Bug? Forgot earlier. A runner I know has something you could probably use. Zip in your deets. Thank you. Gentlemen's videos. Oh, stupid gates busted again. Third time. Paid to get it fixed the last two. Gotta be some kind of scam. Mm hmm. Gonna have a word with the super. Oh, yeah. And we are home. Yay! So, hopefully, my clothes didn't fall off before when I looked in the mirror. And now I've got the nudity filter on. So, oh, the clothes did fall off. Interesting. Lucky I had the filter. I have clothes on. That's super weird. They didn't fix the bug. At least for her. That's too funny. Here is our marvelous stash. And I should have some cool stuff here in the stash. What? Ah, yeah. Well, I don't have the jacket here, but I do have the t-shirt. How strange. I have the jacket in the other playthrough. One, that's very weird. What's in my inventory? Oh, a cool hat. Some shirts. Well, I have the Galaxy t-shirt here. But not... Huh. are better shoes. Huh. strange hmm. or I guess I could sell these guns instead of stashing them oh also a beautiful blade 
this. The black unicorn. It says it has zero DPS. Is that correct? No, that is not correct. Okay, maybe it's random stuff, because I didn't get this stuff. Uh, in the other playthrough, I did not get the kick-ass katana or the knife. Oh, there's the wolf school jacket. There it is. Okay, so we're going to go to the inventory. And we're going to go to shoes. <coughs> we're going to put some damn shoes on our feet. Oh, my hair changes. But I look pretty freaking cool. Well, Daryl Hannah as Pris. As V. Pretty groovy hat. Okay, so that's that. That is pretty freaking classy. I don't think I have anything for the face, no. But, um, jacket is in the stash, right? Yes. No. Where's the... There it is. Pretty freaking cool. She looks neat. Don't you think? I think she does. Let's go check our closet as well. Some Euro dollars. Alright, so we've got platform boots, a 
cool biker jacket, a cap, some athletic shorts, a groovy tank top, some camo stuff, and a cotton long sleeve. That might be better armor. And those might be better boots. Let's have a look. Oh, no. No. My wolf school jacket is better. Definitely. And what are the shoes? Oh, they're the same. I think I would like the titanium layer platform boots, though, frankly. Instead... So let's put that back in the stash. That's in the stash. Look at all those kicks. I think the shorts um, are better armor than my pants, but sometimes we must make sacrifices for style. Lovely. Daryl Hannah as Pris is being freak cool. Now, do her clothes still fall off? Well, she's bald and she has no pants on. But there's definitely a jacket on there. Fascinating. Fascinating. <laughs> oh. Check this out. This is pretty cool. And... chill and watch TV for a while. I don't know why that stash thing is still up. Oh my. Delight paste. Num 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 num. All right. Time for bed, and maybe the stash indicator will go the fuck away. Oh 
oh yeah, I can get a burrito if I'm hungry. Which I think is pretty cool. And then there's a shower in here. Now you're all wet and you're getting into bed. Yeah, those are fun nails. Okay, hopefully the stash will go away. Nope. It's decided it's going to stay there forever. something when I jacked into that corpo's biome on okay street kid one okay fine yeah let's try to reload it the great uh Shooting while moving is less accurate than when in stable position. Well, that makes sense. The city's founder, Richard Knight, was shot on the balcony of his residence in the strange... Dude, you can't, you can't read that. Hopefully the stash thing is, yeah. Looks good, all right, cool. That's an interesting bug. Now, we reloaded. I have a curious. Whoa, V, get your beauty sleep? <laughs> no matter, time you got up. I think I might have caught something. When I jacked into that corpo's biome on. I know a neurovirus or... I need to see Vic. Let him tell me what's got my head reeling and my stomach churning. Okay, let me take you. I brought you a ride. Throw some threads, meet me downstairs. Okay, there's a shirt. Looks like pants, too. All of my hair is gone, but I think it takes the jacket off. Uh... Yeah.
come on. Why you not play it? It is Johnny's classic. Hey V, Regina Jones here. If you're looking for work in Watson, give me a call. How did you find me? How'd you even know my name? I know where to gather my intel. Could even call me a collector. Later, V. MCPD! Open up! What is it, Ben? We gotta go! We're here to help! We know you're in the room! Uh, hey, V. Regina Jones here. I heard you were looking for work in Watson. Just so happens I'm one of its main employers. If you don't want to waste those talents of yours, check the gigs I sent you. Do good work, and there's more where that came from. I'll be in touch. Alright, whatever. Studied Tilda. <laughs> That's all right. A good day to you. my new punching bag just gave me a next-gen ass whooping he did be curious to see how he handles the likes of me <laughs> so how about it uh where'd you get him where'd you get him fred off the streets saw him looking up at me with these big sad eyes oh so the poor pup in that sweet baby <laughs> nah, for real. He's a military boxer. Got a sweet deal. And a tumor mine tossed in a few upgrades. Choo. Now, here we are. How's it going, going? robot? Fight Robo dude. <laughs> Not gonna watch? Take notes? Malone versus Hernandez. <laughs> nah. Our chrome friend here don't watch TV. Don't talk neither. Only way he communicates is with them fists. Sure, let's, let's do, do it. Light on your feet. Keep that head moving. You got one hell of a punch there, Jim. Never thought of monetizing it? I can arrange a fight or two. What do you really? say? Really? I say yes. So, uh, first of all, what do you got for, do sale? You got for sale? Only top shelf gear. I'm gonna sell you a bunch of my guns, okay? I'm gonna sell you that. And I'm gonna sell you that. And I'm gonna sell you that. And I'm gonna keep that. I'm gonna sell you that. I'm gonna keep my blades. Oh, I can sell the junk. Yes.
feeds and consumables. Oh, and these are grenades. I'm not sure what this is. Explosives analysis. Oh, it's a mod. Some kind of cyberware mod. I guess I could probably maybe, I'm not sure where. I could go into crafting and find out, I guess. In any case, yeah. Sell him my stuff. Do you go in the ring yourself? Not anymore. Cole's taking too much of a beating. Reflexes ain't what they used to be. There's ways of fixing that. Karenza cops should do the trick. Rather dish out my eddies for something else. It's time I started taking it easy. So about those fights you, you were talking about. Something about fighting. Yep. Mm. I've seen you land in blows in the rain. You've got sharp instinct, a good edge. You can go far, especially if you get chipped. These fights, let's just say they aren't legal, but. Very lucrative. Lucrative for who? You or me? Both of us. I get a small percentage of the total winnings, you know, as your agent. You get the rest. I'm super good. I'm Sounds in. Fair. It's like I said. Good instinct. Fights happen in different parts of the city. You choose where you want to go. Put down your eddies and start swinging. You win, you take home the pot. Manage to drop every last one of them, you get a chance to fight the grand finale. That all clear? Crystal. Good. Though, except you won't be setting foot outside or what? Not yet. The start of the group. I believe in you, V. Time to show this city what you're made of. All right, bye. Coach Fred says, all right, a couple words about who you're going up against. Kobuki, won't spoil this, just come and see. Arroyo, Buck Fifth Street, Ganger Real P.O.S., Glenn, Cesar, Fists Like Fucking Hammers, Animals Club, Rhino, Woman is a Legend, leaves everyone flat now. Who's just talking to me? You, you were just talking to me. Hello? Let's have a look. Oh, I guess I could have. Maybe sold you things for a better price. I don't know. Maybe not. Oh, that is a, wait, 112 DPS, and this is 140, wow. Let's have a look. 
So where is it? Is it this one? Guns are worse than the one I got. Fuck it, I don't need it. Alright, wait, collect my gun. Let's have a look. Wilson. Where is it? Which one is it? Ah, must be this one, because it's zero dollars for that one, so I'll get it. Upgrading iconic items. An iconic item Along with a set of crafting specs, you can use these to craft better quality versions of this item. When a new version of an icon iconic item is crafted, the original item is destroyed. Iconic items can also be upgraded, just like regular weapons or pieces of clothing. Upgrading improves their levels and slots, ensuring they remain useful to you as you progress through the game. I actually Thanks a lot. do this one. But that's, you know, some XP or whatever, so cool. A job complete. A little out of time. Come on, spread it out. Um, no. No, I'm fine. Crafting. Upgrade, all right, crafting. don't know how to do this. Insufficient components. Okay, well I just, I do not have this stuff. That's fine. Go meet with Jackie. City is beautiful. The game is beautiful. I'm having a good old time. I've been having a good old time all day. NCPD scanner hustles. The NCPD will pay you to help fight crime. Gigs. Fixers will contact you when you approach a gig's location. Fixers. These intermediaries will inform you about local gigs available. So that's it for 
patrol officer. Sit down, let me finish this. Then we can drop in on Senor Vector. Mentioned so. something about a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right, or just had a brain fart? Probably both, because you usually forget shit. But it just so happens, I think I might have bagged us a sweet ass J-O-B. Go on. I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but. Just that he's fronted by a little known someone named Dexter Deshaun. Totally the top fixer in night fucking city. Well, uh, the, there was a chopsticks bug before, and that seems to have been fixed. Uh. Thought Dex bounced out of the ring a few years ago. Messed with a nasty crew in Pacifica. Things got ugly. Mm-hmm. Gang wars two years back. Somehow Dex got caught up in the craziness. A lot of bodies lying in the streets by the time the shooting stopped. Yeah, Dex got lucky though. Managed to slip under the radar till tempers cooled. Took a while, but he's made one hell of a comeback. This doesn't feel right. Guy's up to his elbows in blood, Jack. Do you want to shake his hand? Work with him. It's the biz, V. Everyone's got blood on their hands. You deal with it. You move on. How'd you How'd get you it? How'd you manage to pull this? Trade in your spleen or something? As far as I know, we're not the type to get fingered by Dex. You know me? Oh, a T-Buck. She's the one that hooked us up, got us talking. Knew it was a done deal the moment he laid eyes on me. Cause come on, ain't nobody who can resist this. Am I right? I really do like Jackie. <laughs> sure, Jack. Whatever you say. He's pretty, pretty entertaining. All right, so, so what's, what's his job? Game? We meant to come out in one piece? Well, our savior wants to tell you everything himself. Face to face. No pressure, but old deal's riding on you now, chica. All right, cool. All right. Let's hear what old Dex has to say. Set it up. Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong. Don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but Dex is a league of his own. You know what I'm saying? Don't get me started on fixers. They catch a client, find the cheapest gong to do the job, then drop their corpse at a landfill. Shit. Hit the nail on the head, V. Man, that looks good. Where you in on? Brought your wheels. Gave them to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after our uh, dust off with the scabs. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. The top notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. Are we rolling or what? Yeah, we roll. Let's feel this factory new ride. All right. So, let's get in my car. First stop. Ripper Dock. Anchica, easy on the gas, eh? I just ate. All right. There we go. I was supposed to stop by Vix anyhow. I got a date. Me and Miss D. You don't say. She's so sweet. Really gets me, you know. Okay. Hold on. Whoops. Sorry.
Look at this place. Isn't it? Beautiful. Ah, that may be the mum. Two shakes. Okay. Back to it. Look at how pretty. Man, I, I, does that say poo? No, pod. All right. Hello, Robo Ladies. Do you truly believe that those who have sold you your mechanical eyes have resisted the temptation to peek through? Cameras are all around us, even within us. Your joys, your worries, your life. For them, it is all mere spectacle. The... Let's just say you're right. So what? Should I just gouge out my optics? Nah, oh, thanks, but no thanks. You are beyond salvation. Oh, yeah, but probably. not the children of the future. Life untainted by surgery of the sacrilege. We right, can yet save them. For me. May the oh, hey, Jackie, bodies. what's that? May the fathers instill their hatred for Crow. But who are those Maybe. who follow our every Hey. Day? We'll see you now. I'll sit tight over here. Me and Misty got a little She's clearly modeled after Pris. In their wretchedness, you they placate their Oh look, it's kitty cat. We're going to pet the kitty cat. Oh, we got a cat. Yes, you're so cute. You're the kitty, kitty, kitty. Sweet kitty, kitty. Okay. Sweet kitty, kitty. Yes, you can pet the cat. Vicky's fry as ever, you old ripper. All right. Though a common practice, cyberware installation is still a dangerous and invasive a dangerous and invasive procedure, which can only be performed by qualified specialists. Ripper docks. There are several ripper docks operating throughout Night City, who offer a variety of different cyberware upgrades. Select your desired cybernetic upgrade from the list and enjoy your new abilities. Good to see you. Good to see you too, V. Oh, wow. So what do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neurosocket. Think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Oh, kit and caboodle. All right, kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Pretty Pretty good. Good. Gave me a job. Name's Dexter Deshawn. Known quantity from the afterlife. No denying you're moving up. What? Something you're not telling me, Vic? Keep your guard up, that's all. I've heard some things about Dex. He's not as chill as he makes himself out to be. I need stuff. Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. 
<laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean. Get in the major leagues. Need tech that can perform. The Dexter Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something. But let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Nah, I do not have the money. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later, with interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time, you hear? Swear it. Chair, please. Sit down and relax. Relax. Rest. Kuroshi Optics. Best I've got, and should be about right under the circumstances. Now okay, so, uh, I'm gonna do a photosensitivity warning, just in case. Kuroshi, whoa! Vic, nothing tops that on the market. Uh, hmm. there's gonna be some flashy like flashies, I think. Handy, then. Gave you my word I'd pay you so... back, but this... Might be too rich for my blood. If you are a photosensitive we'll viewer, out. right now I'm just out to uh, make sure you get back in one piece. It is the following in scene may affect you. You peruse and choose while I scan. We'll see what's going on inside. Cybernetic implants are mechanical replacements for the organic parts of your body. They can give you superhuman-like abilities which can improve your combat capability and help you survive in hazardous conditions. Although a common practice in 2077, the installation of cyberware is still an invasive and sometimes dangerous medical procedure. Only specialists known as Ripper Docs are trust trusted to install cyberware safely. Right. There we are. Ha. Uh, yeah, there we go. And we throw you in there. And that is uh, enhances your vision. Empty cyberware mod slot. I guess not. Okay. That's fine. I don't think there's anything else I'm able to get. Yeah, I need more cool. Oh no, I need more street cred. are the only other one. Ballistic coprocessor. I don't.
is on. Anyways. Mark one, like I said. Decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the top's a built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur. And just remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Hmm. This should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech, too. Groovy, man. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. Lay that major league arm of yours right here. Uh, let me stall a minute. So, how are you? So, what's new in the life of Victor Vector? Victor Vector. Well, if I'm being honest, not much, and that's fine with me. I used to live in a world where all that mattered was who's who, what's what, and how's why. And what happened? One day, I just dropped it and never looked back. I'll never be a legend in this town. I've been sleeping nights ever since. All right, let's do this. Just like that, thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. Feel anything? But she didn't say anything. Why aren't they saying anything? Lights out for a minute, all right? That was weird. Okay, let's test this. See the magic in action. Linking you in. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Well, how's it look? Feel all right to you? Oh, this is fantastic, Vic. Oh, beautiful. Okay. Scanning people with your optical cyberware can pr provide you with a lot of useful information, such as how strong an enemy might be, who is in their crew, or what type of weapon they use. As a skilled netrunner, you can see a list of quick hacks, which you can use against your enemies. Time for the scanner. It might take you a few seconds to adjust. First time's really the charm, <laughs> with anything, really. The scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. I also inject an NCPD file search. Sweet. Run into any ne'er-do-wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er did well. <laughs> Database of wanted persons. A database of individuals with bounties assigned to them is now available to use. You can identify these wanted persons with your scanner. Since all are wanted, dead, or alive, the methods you use to claim your reward are entirely up to you. <laughs> it ought to work like a charm. Sweet. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new site. So, what about that, How about the uh, neurovirus? Malfunction. From the last job. Can you check it? Done and gone while we were putting in your implant. And a full sweep on your soft and circuits. Zap the critter. You're certified bug-free. Woohoo! Thanks, Shit, bro. Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now, and another two in an hour. What, what am I looking it? at? A mild stem should boost neurotransmission in the short term and muffle some of the side effects while the implant takes. Okay. You the best. The best. The best, Vic. I owe you. <laughs> Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. And once you hit the big leagues, don't forget where you came from. Guard up, you idiot. Go on, punch.
punch him. What's taking so long? Move your ass, Chica. Dex is waiting on us. Yeah. Who's winning? Hernandez. You know, in the old days, that cripple Malone would have been flat on the boards. Ha. Huh. No, every last fighter's got extra skull lining. Absorb 75% of every blow. You miss it? Miss it, don't you? Ah. Uh. I... I not have money yet. To give. How's Biz going? Uh, can't complain. Corpos learned to keep their distance, and... Sokka's back hiring lone mercs. They all gotta have the newest, shiniest implants. Thing you got Misty here to help. Handles your griping well. Yeah, renting out her shop's the best decision I ever made. You know what? Seems like you're the only person in Night City who's happy with his lot. You get to a certain age, you drop all your illusions. Life it. just gets easier from there. All right, bye. Your hard chakra looks a little out of whack, babe. I can release it for you, but you'd have to watch out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds. Anything red. I can release it for you, but you'd have to watch out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds. Anything red. <sighs> Thanks, Misty. You're the best. And your aura. It needs tending, baby. You've got to brush it daily. It's just no good if you don't. How do you brush it? Make sure your aura? hands are clean and caress the filaments of light along their length. Oh, I see. They'll be strong then. They'll be firm. Uh-huh. Firm. <laughs> okay. V, Hi. Yo, listen up. I talked to Dex while you were in with the doc. He's waiting in his ride. For you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked. Next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay. Do my best to talk us out. All right. V, listen. I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. The number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now, that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Well, that's right. Nice. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip of... Okay. Uh. Wanted for battery of a public official. On a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tack hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate no the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. with the animals. Looks like he's weak to electricity. That's all clear. What is no. Uh, incapacitating enemies. There are various ways to incapacitate enemies without killing them. Non-lethal takedowns, non-lethal quick hacks, non-lethal weapons, EMP grenades, and some combat gadgets. Weapon mods that change damage to non-lethal if a given weapon, combat gadget, or quick hack 
deals non-lethal damage, it will be mentioned in the description. No, I don't want to track that job. I just want to... That is an NCPD Netrunner. Hey, it ain't so bad, Scarecrow. Hello. Yo, Miss V. A pleasure. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> Let's roll. Mind if I ask you something right off the bank? Would you rather live in peace as Miss Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? It's first place or no place, Dex. Cost isn't a factor. <laughs> Classic. I'd expect nothing less from eager, supple youth. <laughs> Respect. All right, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scab home. So hey, why are we doing this? My own now. Why all this, Dex? Why me? Could have had Jackie or T-Bug sitting here. Could have just done this on comms. Call me old fashioned, but I like to look anyone I do biz with in the eye. Had the pleasure of meeting the Jackster in the past. And Sweet T-Bug helped this brother out two years ago. So here we are. Here we are. Besides all that, got a special little pre-mission just for you. But we'll get to that. Okay, tell Let me, me about it. the job. What's the job? The job. This prototype tech. A biochip to be precise. Job's to grab it. Simple. Hmm. Guessing it belongs to a corp? Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. That's probably a death sentence. That's no, terrible. No, no problem. Just a death sentence. <laughs> we learned Arasaka's earlier. Turf. Nobody fucks with them here. Yeah. What can I say, Miss V? High risk, high reward. First rule of the afterlife. Besides that, I'm no lead here. Ain't gonna leave no trace for them to follow because we're gonna do this clean and on the hush hush. We understand each other? Sure. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolving that. Second's a rendezvous. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. Tell me about. My client, please. Client. What's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. And the convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leave you. That's all right. I'm very charming. Tell me about Maelstrom. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shot. Oh, yeah. All right. I got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got uh, photosensitivity, maybe? Corp warning? Don't even no maelstroms involved. Not sure. I'm not sure what uh, sets now, off see, that sort of thing. Convoy was carrying the flathead, a 
little combat bot a prototype, then I need me that bit of high grade military tech. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. The problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate, one Simon Randall, AKA Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now. I don't and know I if no this is no laggy or it's supposed to, to be this way. Word. To this shit from I one think it's just laggy as hell. Has developed an interest in said convoy. Tell me, a Royce guy, what's he like? A straight psychopath, chrome loving kind. Big club in this town. I'll give you that. Except few of its other members, no matter the stakes, would put a friend and associate through an industrial microwave dryer. Apparently, first thing to burst are the eyeballs. Get a nice clear pop. Then the rest goes goulash. And the lady? Who's the prima donna? Corporal agent. Internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip-tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter. So she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. Awesome. Think I got everything. Time I got to work. Let's do it. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. One more thing, Miss B. Quiet life or blaze of glory? Hmm? Later now. Bye. Okay. Performing certain action will reward you with street cred. Build your street cred to make a name for yourself in the Night City Underworld. Doing so will open up new opportunities. Jackster, talk to Dex. <laughs> Gordito's a big deal. Literally a nod, yeah. Guy certainly knows how to protect his biz. Wants to put us on a few small kinks. Prep work, I guess. Before lining us up a big job. There's this combat bot military prototype. Maelstrom clipped it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. Is the, how about a little something to get those taste buds tingling? The biochip in question is in fact the so-called relic. A Nova tier piece of tech catering to the top 1%, supposedly the best life insurance money can buy. You and I are going to be neck deep in dollars, I guess. versus Brick. Hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deeds of some Militech agent, too, but don't know how much help she stands to be. <laughs> yeah, you don't sound thrilled. Royce, what do you know about him? He's fucking whack something special. Junkie snort junk. Royce snorts chrome. Oh. You saw the appearing pillow, yeah? Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table, Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. I 
must know what he's doing. So, how you want to play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? We do Maelstrom first. I say we knock on Maelstrom's door first. Pound, actually. What I lay. In that case, I'll hit the all foods. Put my nose to the ground. Step around. Hasta luego. don't know what that did, but it wasn't what I wanted to do. Oh, there's my car. Ah, there we go. Meredith Stout. Telling me how you got this number. No more than your number. Heard you misplaced a convoy. You shut him up. <laughs> Spill what you know. Don't make me wait. Nah, -uh. not on the horn. Let's meet. Cut a deal. A deal. Fine. First exit off Skyline, driving towards the NID. Storm Channel under the overpass. Meet you there. Let's go a drive in. See if I can find this place a little bit more easily than I did uh, last time. Look at beautiful Night City. Nothing going on over here. Copper. Spent a little while trying to figure out. to get here to this place before. Much easier time of it this time. Kill out. Look lively. Meredith Stout. Take it you were the one to call? It's me. Say anything in, on time. Christ, Meredith! Shut your traps! That fucking thing ready? All set. Now answer my questions. Honestly, forthrightly. Are you here alone? Yes, it only me. 
Yep. <clears throat> Just little old me. It's the truth. Do a sweep now. Now listen. This piece of shit, Anthony Gilchrist. Is he your contact? Is he the one who leaked intel on the convoy? I don't know that, that guy. guy. Never seen him before. Checks out. Listen, I know where the transport is. I can help you. Just want a favor in return. <sighs> I told you! I fucking told you! I'm not the mole! Jesus Christ! Shut him up! Unhand me now before I... <sighs> Hi. Or you can let go. Wanna hear what she has to say? All right, handsome. I need a bot. Flathead model. Guys who ripped you off have it. Promise me that bot. I'll point your finger. You have a plan how to deal with them? Could just take it by force, but they're expecting payment, so I could go that route too. Fine, the latter. But on one condition. You pay with our money. Okay. Sounds solid enough. I'm in. Okay, encrypted shard. Some shards you find in the world will contain information hidden behind data encryption measures. To decrypt a shard, first either open it through the notification when you acquire it, or find it later in the shards tab under journal in the main menu. Then select Crack Security to unlock its secret. You pay with that chip, and that's all you gotta worry about. Try uh, sure. Alright, I'm not really sure. Aw, oh, crap. Fuck me in any way, and I'll be seeing you real soon. You're making a mistake! This cunt's already good as dead! And she'll take you down with her! I will not. Let me try to get that, uh, crack that shard here. Shards. Okay, I got the first one. Alright. Eddie's on the cred ship are clean. Okay. Oh, uh... Car. Heh.
I? headed the right way. And now we're not. Excuse me! Oh, no. Yes? Yes. Yeah, here we go. Oh, no, it's down there in it. No, 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 we're good. We're good. I don't know why I can't get through there, but... Hello, car. Don't run me over. Ah, there you are. Let me hear what you squared away. T-Bug show any sign of life? You two talk? She's up to date, fired up to work with Dex. Preparing already. All right. They're familiar, you know? Worked together before Dex took his break. Hope he hasn't been waiting, waiting too long. I had to go madre always talk said to that corpo. So, Dex already paid the Maelstromers for the Corpo bot. Thing is, can't be sure the gang goons are still willing to hand it over. He paid up front? Híjole. I know. Well, whatever. Let's go get this tech. Is it yet? You got a plan? Yep. Militech and me, we found some common ground. They're footing the bill for the bot. There's a lot of scratch to toss away. Forget it, Jack. It'll be like we never had it in the first place. Anyway, who knows how this deal's gonna shake out. So, into the Borg Beast then? Yep, let's, let's go do see it. these bastards. All right, let's knock on their door. See if they even so, um, my last place, my other playthrough went uh, poorly. So, I think nice. maybe, Board hopefully, fuckers. this one will go. Had to be them. Just a gang like any other, right? Teeny tiny bit better. Like the Valentinos. <laughs> they follow God and the Santa Madre. Honor means something to them. You know what they want, how they get it, and what pisses them the fuck off. Oh, and hey. The Elstrom, you just never know. Can I level up yet at all? Oh, I can. Let's do that real quick. Um... Definitely want to up technical ability. And of course. 
Cheers. We're gonna... Up some stealth, I guess. allows you to perform non-lethal, right? And that is good with silenced weapons, but I do not have silenced weapons right now. Uh, carrying capacity or regeneration. I think I should take regeneration. That'll help me not get killed. Oh, hi. <clears throat> Don't know you. Dex Wanna talk us. to Royce? Dex sent us. Main room. We've been waiting. I'm so glad. I don't think I've ever seen security like this in a jail factory. Uh, gear from the Jack Convoy. Gotta be. Must have been all over it like maggots on dead meat. Yeah, it went very poorly. Anti-personnel mine. Directional <coughs> shrapnel spitter. My favorite. Subtle. Okay, <laughs> okay. Hopefully, I, I I believe this might go better this time because I made a different choice. Model MT-0 D-12, called the Flathead. And? The hell you care? It's Guy I represent already paid Brick for it. I'm just here for the pickup. I can talk direct to Royce if necessary. Nah, you talk to me. Name's Tum Tum. Now couch, planet. Jeez. Guys, come on. This so fucking hard? 
fucking ass on the fucking couch. Make me. Thought you never asked. Guys. Sit your ass down for a planet bullet in your skull. Jack, sit down. This ain't gonna end well, but... Shit. Well, all right. Come on. Gotta lighten up. Take a hit. Sure. What you blowing? Black lace. Tough to get your hands on. Gotta have a good source. What's it do? Ups dwarfs and adrenaline to the point you feel no pain. Trip so intense it verges on psychosis. Corpse fed it to their fighting legions during the Corp Wars. Cyber psychos pop the tabs like candy. I didn't get this. Vaporizing it mellows the bird without killing any of the effect. On my other Come on! Give it a whirl! Sure. Absolutely. Now we can talk. Here we go. A flathead. Model MT0 D12. Show me. see it. enough technology for special yep we'll take it three sure yeah let's see a cred brick got it it's all paid out brick got it uh. i don't see any fucking brick around here do you no all right fuck brick then Let's cut a new deal. Now that's good business sense. All right, you want the flathead? I better see some eddies. Yeah, okay. Relax. Got him right here. Just like that. Without batting a fucking eye. <laughs> You're not short, sir. I got places to be. You know, you never did say who sent you. Never did say who you're working for. Dexter Deshaun. That's who. Dexter Deshaun. The lord ass who punching animal fucked half a Pacifica. <laughs> so he ain't dead. So I'm gonna consider my offer now. Here's the cred. Hell, I'll even toss in some info as a friendly bonus. Militech's on to you. They're close. Wait, what? Cred chip was spiked with a virus. But don't worry, I wiped it. Check it. Okay, hopefully this worked. Go now. Yeah? You 
you just take the damn bot and get the fuck out of my factory? Great. If this is a trick, I'm gonna introduce you to our Got meat me. grinder. Nova, so now leave. And hey, after you get Dex's dick out of your mouth, tell him I say hello. <laughs> More their fucking stylists. We'll ride the production line. Flip it on. went so poorly last time. I end up. Bad place. Not good place. Ooh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Sadly, I got stuck. But having that katana, boy, that sure is fun. If I hadn't have gotten stuck like that, I think uh, that would have gone much better than the um, first campaign.
I go. I literally was not going to attack you at all. But you had to start with your nonsense. Get out of here. Check ages. All right. we should probably equip, equip a gun. How do you um, go back and forth between weapons? That's my question. Get the fuck off! 
That is a great freaking gun. Tell you what. Anything to say? What? Thanks, V. Ricochet weapons. Power weapons allows you to control the we the direction of bullet ricochets if you have ballistic coprocessor cyberware and the trajectory generator mod for Kiroshi Optics installed. I don't think I do. <laughs> for fucking what? For saving your sorry tin can ass. <laughs> Are you fucking high? Oh, you're fucked. Fuck, you know that? <laughs> For now, I'm alive, they're not. But they'll be back. Militech's good at nurturing grudges and at killing. Long as you know whose balls to grip, you decide who lives and dies. Wise words. Remember them. Alright, bye. Here you go. Ooh. Yeah, I'll take the legendary the item component. Thank you. Your S key? Let's say I like that you got good taste. Go on, it's yours. Thank you. I can't fucking believe that guy. So that actually did go a lot better uh, than the other one. So that's nice. I had to I had to flee entirely. No. Come on, V. Let's get out of here. Little dick. You got those things buzzing around everywhere. Past the gate. We can talk there. Um Uh, uh D dude. Let me through. Ha <laughs> ha. 
That's really weird. There's no way out. <coughs> <coughs> Jackie just walked through the... Actually, literally through the closed door. And then there was no... Way to open it. This game is still very buggy. Um, but you know, I'm old school. There it is. <laughs> All the games way back in the day were buggy, glitchy, janky messes. Wait! Hold your fire! Open fire! I'd like a word with them. Gilchrist? Shot at my people. They shot first. They drew and fired first fact of no consequence to Militech management. But if you'd worked with Stout, I'd be dead by now. Might not have intended it, but you saved my life. Now I'm saving yours. Makes us even. Uh, thanks? Appreciate it. You're not half bad. Caring for my interests, not yours. You were followed, but I'm sure you know that. Stout's people were on your tail, my people were on theirs. In the end, she lost her nerve. Thought she hopped in bed with Maelstrom behind her back. Hit the big red button prematurely. Classic. And you don't know what to do. Why not order an all-out assault on a food factory? Mm-hmm. About sums it up. I made sure it blew up in her face. Good. Business Bye. with Maelstrom. Hardly ever ends well, does it? So what happened to What her? happened to Stout? She placed some bad bets. Her clock ran out. Simple as that. Suffice to say, you won't be seeing her again. And you? Why are you here? What she want? Well, I still don't know who the mole is. I was hoping the Maelstromers would shed some light on it. By the way, where's Royce? Need a word with him, too. It's been a pleasure. Uh, bye. I guess. Jackie! Holy shit, V. I was sure we'd walk out in one piece. Yeah. Pretty you awesome. make a good team, Jack. I think you might be right. In any case, I don't regret switching my life up the way I did. Now that'd be the sweet taste of success, my friend. Hey, call up Dex, let him know we got his toy. Meeting to celebrate at the afterlife. How you luego, V? How things looking, Miss V? It's good. And how'd it go? Run into any trouble? And what about the Militech angle? Sure, of course there was trouble. Royce couldn't have given two shits that you and Brick had shaken him. How'd you get him on board? You use the corpo woman? Met with Stout, managed to strike a deal. Well, well. Gave me the chip with the scratch for Maelstrom. I warned Royce. We made a deal. You got some balls, Miss B. What about the meet with Evelyn Parker? Still on the to-do list. <laughs> that meet's the only thing that'll get you a chance at grabbing that chip. Park will be waiting for you at this bar. Good luck. Let's do it. Hey -o. Level up again, we did. Better nice. All right. All right. Good. So. Uh, 
I prefer working with the melee weapons to the guns. Although the guns aren't bad now that I'm reflexes five. They're terrible at lower levels. Oof. Lower than five. Oof. They're bad. Um, yeah. Let's get you up. One. As you don't lock doors, use tech weapons. Increase the level, increase your combo by 5%. I feel like I should just try to get everything up to at least 5, and then I can go from there. open up groovy perks, you know. I don't know. Dialogue options, the like. Let's just get tech ability up to five. And now we'll look at some stealth perks. for silenced weapons. That's a cool new move. Um, let's see. I don't have any intelligence perks. What do we got here? Oh, these are for breach protocol. And quick hack. Cover during combat. That's pretty cool. Reveals an enemy netrunner when they're attempting to hack you. Oh, yeah. I'll take that one. Thank you. damage from strong attacks with blunt weapons, blunt weapons, blunt weapons, blunt weapons, but I use a sharp weapon. These are all for blunt weapons, huh? and light machine guns. No.
Oh, technical ability increases your armor by 5%. We have an engineering here. We have reduces damage, take it from explosives. better looting of drones and robots and things, immunity to effects from your own grenades, <laughs> the explosion radius of grenades is visible. Cold blood attributes here. Let's see. Will to survive increases all resistances by 2.5% per stock of cold blood. Uh, after defeating an enemy, gain cold blood for 10 seconds and increase movement speed by 2%. Stocks up to one times. Reduces weapon recoil by 2.5% per stock of cold blood. Well, I mean, why not? Right on. making me go the wrong way, bro. Bart must collect. First will come the great reality check, which ushers in the future of the world. All right, bro, ski. We're just gonna turn around, all right? Oh. How's that do? Good? Good. There it is. All nice and not on its back anymore. That's a good thing. Oh, don't run over any homeless people now. That's not a good idea. Uh, Scott, I like it so far. I like it. Um, it's, it's good. There's a lot of bugs still. Uh, 
but those I'm sure will get patched out. Um, I'm going to be playing it for a very, very long time. I'm going to be playing a lot of it. Um. Most assuredly. is beautiful. I mean, look at this. Liver punch booze, you know? A beautiful, beautiful place. seen it but it reminds me of Blade Runner yes very much so um my V I made her look like Daryl Hannah as Pris in Blade Runner um ow that sucked as much as I possibly could So lost here in Night City. <laughs> no, that's not what I wanted to do at all. Let's get back on up. Word of a cyber psycho attack, all confirmed. Even reported to Max Tech. Thing is, nobody's gonna show because Militech shut it right down. You ask me, psycho's gotta be one of theirs. My eddies are on Lieutenant Mower. Anyway, Corporal's gonna go straight into treatment. So make very, very sure you keep her in one piece. I am not doing your job right now, lady. Okay, so all I know is that a cyber psycho attack was reported to Max Tech, but Miltech didn't and took over probably because it was one of their own, a woman named Mower, serving in Miltech's elite division. Be careful, all right? Yeah, totally. I'll totally be careful. Because 
I'm not doing that dang old mission right now. Okay. Okay. Right now, I'm trying to get to... Sorry, Lizzie's bar. Oh no. Okay, um, shit. Are we still on the air? We have an error. I'm not quite sure what to do. I should probably go ahead and sign off. Well, I can, um, because it's checking the error status and it hasn't kicked me off yet. So, join me please tomorrow. Thank you so much for uh, joining me tonight. If you enjoyed hanging out with me, playing Cyberpunk. Um, 